Hey guys, uh, we are fishing in a uh, neighborhood pond today, a big private pond. I have permission to come fish here. Apparently they have a lot of big bass and we will see if uh, the rumors hold to themselves or hold true, prove themselves to be true. Lost for words here. So right here is the lake. They have two. This is the first one we're going to be fishing. I don't know if you can see it, but it looks really good. Let's get out there. I'm seeing a lot of activity out here on the water. Right now I'm throwing a tournament here. He's a six foot six medium heavy uh, with a speed spool lose. I think it's like six four ratio. I'm throwing a Cinco right now. Be a the water, and we'll get back to you. All right, so stuff. just notified me that this pond was built about a year ago and has fish that are about that big. So I've been fishing for about two hours in a pond that has fish that are no bigger than five inches long. So I'm going to go run to the second pond and I will uh, see you guys whenever I get there. Alright, so I am here. I'm parked in front of a sailed lot. Won't cause any trouble. Um, this is the second pond and apparently a friend of mine has caught a six pounder out of here. And there is more where that came from. So let's see if this is the actual lake they were talking about, because the last one was for sure not the lake they were talking about. A useful tip to use when fishing in a pond that you've never fished before is always look for the drains. If you see a drain, there's normally going to be a couple fish hanging out in front of there. And I stepped in an ant pile at the same time. Been fishing for freaking at least an hour. Went around the pond twice and finally got connected. Little guy, but I've seen a big one smash some shiners. So if I have my jerk bait with me, I'll go definitely try that out. Let's get a little release. <laughs> 